justify the reasoning as to why they treat you the way they do why they act like the way that they do or more importantly why with the four of wands and nine of swords um the relationship you guys have is the way that it is all right and this is somebody here who's like feeling guilty for sabotaging y'all um or trying to sabotage you purposely here um for trying to uh how do you say ruin your your fear um you know bring your worst fears to light trying to get people to be fearful of you not believe you I believe crazy ass shit about you here or this is definitely somebody here who with the four of wands they could have like spent a lot of time effort energy and money uh, with the justice card to make it seem like you know um, that you are very secretive, that you are very rude, you are very mean, um, you're a very hateful person, or you're a demonic person, all right, you work the dark arts, or like you're a fucking devil, or whatever it is, um, the reason to outcast you, okay, whether they're outcasting you from a family, from the whole entire family, or like, uh, excommunicate you, or more importantly, take you out of the will, um, you know, hold back your inheritance or your assets or whatever it is, or, um, to try to sabotage you in whatever ways and options and time that they motherfucking then try, okay? Yeah, I feel like whoever this person is, this is somebody here with the two of clubs here, um, you know, on the outside, people may think you guys have a good relationship here, or they may try to um, manipulate people here, or make it uh, people think that you guys have a very fair, uh, rest, rest, reciprocal, excuse me, relationship. But in reality, it's like you always try to give, give, give this person, and they never reciprocate it back. With the pages towards this could also be somebody here who like they're always in your motherfucking business nine of wands you have no privacy around this person or with the will of fortune like their goal or like what they do is like you know they try to um with the hermit card um this is somebody who does a lot of things to you behind the scenes here or may try to make it seem like you know um they they flip-flop so this person either plays the victim here or they're the ones like antagonizing you. Like if they're not um, manipulating people's minds, okay, into thinking that you are attacking them or you're doing this to them or you're acting this way or you're saying this or whatever it is. Um, if they can manipulate people into thinking that, they go as far as like, you know, doing dark arts, putting things in your food, doing spell work, trying to bind you. All right. This is like leaving you out of certain um, inheritances, taking you off of wheels, um, going through your stuff, you know, um, not getting giving you the privacy you need not being fair to you or reciprocal to you with the four of wands trying to uh, diminish um or make other people who are your family members or family friends or whatever it is or people that they know that you meet whether you guys are like related or not um cut you off or not deal with you or like more importantly if you have like certain karmics or narcissists or different things like that like they the type of motherfucker to team up with them if they meet them or they know, uh, they know them and like you're the common enemy or the common cause queen of cups for some of you guys excuse me a fucking uh, mother figure or aunt or a cousin here all right um but yeah this is somebody here with the moon card who, who i feel like you know they're realizing that with the nine of swords all this shit is about to come to light okay or it's already came to light because you could definitely be an empress okay or you could be somebody here with six pentacles so you've always been fair or you've always been just and this shit about to fucking come to light here and this person is trying to hurry up and take the clips like um get it together or four pentacles i'm getting like more importantly get whatever they need to get off their chest i'm also hearing that song grandma got ran over by a reindeer i don't know why um but yeah with the lover's car energy this is definitely um somebody who's trying to make a change here or ace of swords they want to speak their truth or be truthful or two of wands now they may even try to help you or be on your team or i feel like the towers already came okay the towers already came the towers already here you cannot stop the fucking tower moment but it's gonna be somebody here who's gonna try to get on your side or want you to make a decision regarding them or somehow some way make it to work with the lover's card they can save your ass because at the end of the day you're still their cousin you're still their mom you're still their dad you know they're still your mother your father they're still you know your sibling or whatever it is with the high priestess but with the three cups energy i feel like this person has plotted against you with other people here are conspired against you with the ace of wands energy for quite some time with the age of swords and i feel like you've already came um, from under this person's spell with the four of cups here and they may be able to manipulate motherfuckers that you a demon you crazy you dish you dead but um I feel like everybody's as a collective is going to come from underneath this type of brainwash and realize like, okay, with the Emperor card, this person is the true problem with the Nine of Pentacles and this person was doing this single-handedly or this is how this person feels, Two of Cups, Ace of Cups here, all right, with Page of Wands and everybody who's on the outside looking in or didn't know that you were being targeted or that you were going through this, these people will be shocked here with the Nine of Cups or with the information that comes up to the surface or what being exposed. All right, collective, let's go ahead and get some Oracle, all right, um, like this video if it does resonate for you. 
Um, but yeah, like I said, whoever this person is collected, they're going to be real fucking sad, like I said, because this person could have the strength or you had the strength here when this person was doing all this stuff towards you. All right. Um, the clarity, the understanding, or you were grounding yourself this whole entire time and you remember everything they did, they said, or, you know, the outlandish shit that really motherfucking happened here. Regardless, they try to make motherfuckers think you crazy or whatever it is. And I feel like all these person's spontaneous movements, they have had grace for a long time, but that same great, that same grace is not saving their ass no more. All right, like I said, detoxification and all this shit is coming to fuck out. All right, this person could be trying to ground themselves here, but like I said, your um your spiritual team or your ancestors is very upset with this person. All right, and they know this shit. That's why this person is unable to expand, unable to move forward. You may even have realized this person here, their magic does not work anymore. They're not that powerful, or more importantly, like they could be like in a state of confusion here, or like if they had people under a state of confusion, people are not confused anymore, or they could be the ones experiencing health issues, compute um confusion, or not really feeling expired or motivated here, and I feel like they could be getting comfortable or stagnant at this current time being here but this is all going to be wrapping up here and through coming through the grapevine this will be talked about through the grapevine here and expect people to be trying to bandwagon you or come out of this energy where they're viewing your insurance transformation or viewing you as a pure vessel or a pure person despite this person trying to demonize you or make you seem like that you ain't have your shit together or more importantly that like you know whatever attitudes you have or however you were being presented it you know whatever they said this community of people this is how you really was okay um so yeah that's exactly what's going on here you know motherfuckers are waking up you know this is that 2024 a lot of things a lot of people waking up a lot a lot of different